गुड मॉर्निंग व्यूअर बी एंड दिस योर ब्रेकिंग न्यूज या प्लेकाजोन्स और अमंग द सिंपलीस्ट एनिमल्स एंड ऑकर वर्ल्ड इन कोस्टल वोटर्स इट वॉज प्रीवियसली एज्यूम दैट द टीनी क्रिएचर्स विथ मेजर जस्ट ए फ्यू मिलीमीटर्स लिप आइदर ऑन हार्ड सर्फेसेस सच एस रॉक्स कोरल्स एंड मैनग्रोव ट्रूट्स और फ्लोट इन ओपन कोस्टल वाटर एज सो कॉल्ड स्वर्मोर स्टेजेस Through analysis of DNA traces in the stomachs of predatory sea slugs, a team led by a Lemieux geobiologist, Professor Grutt, has demonstrated that the animals also live in the seabed sediments, a habitat they were previously thought not to colonize. In addition, they are more genetically diverse than had been known as the researchers report in the. Journal Ecology and Evolution. With their flat, dick-shaped bodies, all placodons worldwide look strangely similar. Nevertheless, were any stream were already able to demonstrate in previous studies that there are huge genetic differences between them. These differences are comparable with those between humans and mice. Emphasizes. and geobiologist due to their diminutive size and conspicuousness placodons are challenging to study in their natural environment to gain a better insight into the ecology of the animals the researchers exploited the fact that small shellless sea slugs from the rhodopidae family feed on placodons yeah they think they hope to they could find undigested remains of placodons in the stomach contents of the snails which we could then perform molecular analysis on recounts dr michael itel lead author of the study to this end we bioinformatically investigated publicly accessible genetic data for the Snails for traces of placodon DNA. To the researchers' surprise, they also identified the DNA of placodons in the stomachs of snails that live exclusively in seabed sediments, a habitat that all experts had previously ruled out for the every fragile placodons. Clearly, and how were they are present in sediments is a normal occurrence. and could even play a key role in their biology particularly in their sexual reproductions about which we have only rudimentary knowledge says itel furthermore the scientist discovered an unexpectedly large genetic diversity in the stomach contents of just two snails they found five genetically different lineages of which three had never been described before in the view of the researchers this indicates that the diversity of placodons is much greater than previously assumed beyond the exclusive report